Hey, hey everyone, happy Tuesday. It's time to transform our bodies. We're gonna do a balance workout today. We really wanna stay strong and stable for the rest of our lives. So I love to bring in these balance moves to kind of um, throw, it up, uh, throw things up in the air and give you guys a little bit of something different and something really challenging that your body needs on a daily basis. You can grab a chair to help you with this. I'm tucking in my shirt so it doesn't fly out. Um, grab a chair or have a table next to you or you can grab the wall. If you're not able to hold your balance upright, we're not gonna need the chair for everything. Um, probably just two, maybe three moves. Um, so we're gonna start with a lateral leg reach touchdown. We're gonna do a single leg hip rotation, single leg lift and chop. Then we're gonna do some sing, um, side lunge holds and then a straight leg rotation. Okay, so we're gonna get started right now. Good morning, good morning. I see you guys all coming in here. Let's get our warm up on and get started. So first thing we're gonna do today is we're gonna do some around the world. So I want feet a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. You're gonna go down and sweep the ground, press your booty back, weights in the heels, and full rotation around. Sweep and around. You notice I'm lifting each foot up off the ground to engage those legs and thighs. Thighs, glutes. Core, pull that core up, elongate your core. We're doing eight on each side. Last two on this side, and then we're gonna stop and go the other way. And switch sides, press through those glutes, really reach to each side. Get those obliques and that core warmed up. Hey, 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 I see you guys popping in. We're just starting on our warm up. Two more, warm up those legs, those glutes, and done with that. Okay, so we're gonna do a double squat pulse here. Feet are a little bit wider than shoulder width apart, and you stay behind the toes. Elongate the torso, pull that rib cage in, zip it up, lock it, and we're gonna squat back and pulse. Squeeze the glutes, squat back, squeeze the glutes. Oh, I see an ant on my floor. Lord, I don't need ants. We're gonna have to get you, little guy. Come closer. <laughs> Seven, eight, nine, we're gonna go right into a Squat, open palm twist, two more. I think this guy is lost. Last one. I'm searching my floor right now with my eyes, guys. Okay, we're gonna go into open palm twist. So, hands. Elbows are bent, hands are pointed up towards the ceiling, core is fully engaged. Shoulder blades are pinched together like you're holding a pencil. You're gonna turn, look to the back, and front. <sighs> nice, even moves. Keep that core engaged, soft knees. Arms are in line with your shoulders. Pinch those shoulder blades, hold on to that pencil. Squeeze those glutes. You're firing inner thighs, hips are turning on this. Whew. Nice deep breath. Keep going. Last two. Pinch those shoulder blades. Whew. Okay, let's do some heart rate. Lifting our heart rate, elevate it. Okay, so we're gonna do jumping jacks or a step jack. So step jack, step jack. Just like you do a jumping jack. Good morning, good morning, who's popping in here? Hello, hello, or jumping jack. Three, four, five, six, seven, pull the core in. Nine, 10, don't let that tummy shake. 
Hold it as tight as you can. And we're doing 10 more. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Whoo, shake it out. Shake it out. Let's get those arms going. Some arm movement. Okay. Monkey pumps. Soft knees. Core is engaged. Pull everything up. Tight. Pull it in. Pull that navel up to your rib cage. It's in the spine and up towards the rib cage. Seven, eight, press it in. Nine, ten, two more. And last one. Whoo, shake that out. Okay, we're gonna get into this balance movements, okay? So lateral leg touchdown. Ready? So this is really just a side lunge with the touchdown. Big words, lateral leg reach. Here we go. Whew. Side lunge, touchdown. Back up and up. Side lunge, touch to the outside of your foot and back up. Three. I forgot my music today, guys. Four. Whew. Five. No singing. <laughs> Seven, press through those heels. Glutes are engaged outside of the foot. Reach. Whew. Two more. And two. Whew. Switch sides. Whew. Nice deep breath in. And here we go. And side lunge, touchdown. Nice and slow. Take your time. Do not slam those feet back down. I want them nice and soft. No stomping. <sighs> Touch to the outside of the leg. Push off through the heel and the pad to get yourself back to center. <sighs> Side lunge touchdown. <sighs> Three more. Two, press back on the glute so you're not damaging the knee. Okay, here we go. This is a single leg hip rotation. We haven't done these in a while. So you can hold a chair, a wall, a table. If you're unstable, feet are shoulder width apart. Lift the knee and we're rotating. Two, bring it all the way around. Full rotations. If your leg doesn't come up that high, you can do low rotations. It's going to open up that hip flexor area. Feel those glutes or you're up high. Hips are square, facing forward as if you're on a balance beam and you've got to stay on. So you are fully square. Three, two, one, Whew. switch sides. Deep breath in, here we go. Get ready to raise that knee up and square hips. Plant yourself in the ground. Feel yourself being planted in the ground. Push your foot down on the floor. Here we go, up, swing. Love you guys, I see hearts coming in. Always love those hearts. Three, four, Full rotations, dynamic flexion and extension, full foot plant, seven, eight, nine, chin is up, shoulders are relaxed, two more, and one. Okay, we're going to do a single leg lift and chop. So you can use weights if you want. It's going to be definitely a challenge with weights and or you or you don't have to so single leg single leg lift and chop Woo! lift chop Whew. Whew. Yee. bring it 
back to center, up and down. And you can put your toe on the ground for better <laughs> balance, just the toe. I'm trying to get better balance for myself, so I lift it off the ground. And chop, two more. Whew. Last one, chop. Switch legs. Oh my goodness, my legs are tired from yesterday's workout. Here we go. Ready? Deep breath in. And foot comes up. And we're lifting. And chop. And chop. I always start with my weaker leg. I'm not chopping across my body. I'm supposed to chop across your body, Lisa. It's a chop. <laughs> Nine, ten, two more, chop, and chop. Okay. Whew. We're going to do a side lunge hold now. So come to center. We're going to step out to the side, push back in the lunge. I want this heel and toe flexed, and you're just holding. Holding, holding, holding. Remember, this is a 40 second hold. Stretch that inner thigh. <sighs> Press the booty back. Feel the engagement in the quads, the hamstrings, the glutes. Chin up, chest up, shoulders back. Core is engaged fully. You're not bent over. You are upright. <sighs> Toes lifted off the floor. And 10, 9, 8, press, 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 4, 3, 2, ah! and 1. We're going to switch sides. Here we go. Stand tall, take a deep breath in. And step out to the side, back leg is straight, push through the quads, push through the glutes, weight is in that toe and heel, I mean pad and heel, pressing your arch down, lift the toe up, body is upright, press into that inner thigh, stretching it while you're doing this. Press back, we don't want any knee pain, so press back, this toe, knee stays behind the front toe. <sighs> yep, keep pressing. Three, four, five, six. I'm distracted, I see ants. I'm not sure where they're coming and going to, but I see them. We are almost there. You've got 10 seconds left. Nine, press back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, whoo, and one. Okay, you guys, last movement. You can hang on to something to do this. This is a straight leg rotation. So it's a ballet move. Your bottom leg, your toe is just slightly angled out. It is not straight ahead. We need to have balance here because we're on one leg. So a slight turn, it's, almost, it's like if you were in first position in ballet. So a slight turn, soft on the bottom knee. You're gonna pick whichever leg you're doing, the toe is pointed, soft bottom leg, squeezing through the glutes, lift that leg up and turn it all the way and come down, okay? Two, three, and squeeze with these rotations. Four, body is up. Pressing through those heels and that pad. Nice work. Try to keep that leg straight as it rotates. I'm 
Last two, you guys. Up, rotate, and in, and in. Okay, switch sides. I am gonna use my wall to do this so I don't kick something here. Here we go, arm out to the side, starting with that first position, and here we go, straight leg, rotations. Bottom leg, remember that bottom leg, knee is soft, behind the toes. Woo! Full rotations, you guys. Point that toe, feel it in the glute. You should really be feeling this in your glutes. And squeeze and around. And four more. Soft arm. And up and around. And around. Last two, y'all. Woo! I'm gonna hear my hips popping. And done. Okay. Two to four more sets of that. 20 to, uh, 30 to 60 seconds between. Get after it, you guys. So great to be here. Thanks for coming in. I appreciate you guys all being here. Have a wonderful Tuesday. Transform your mind, your body, your spirit. Stay happy. Be happy. It's a great day today. I love you all.